So with the race for numbers comes, uh, of course, uh, coming in unconventional ways. Uh, you know, people across the country are trying to get Kenyans to go out and register as voter. Zakisa Wandera takes a look at these unorthodox ways that uh, is trying to get people out there to go out and register, which IBC has so far termed as inappropriate. Take a look. <laughs> A high-stakes general election, it would appear, is what is in store for Kenya. A voter registration campaign run by the youth in Kisumu seemingly turned into an extortion spree. <laughs> Kisumu County Governor Jack Ranguma had to part with some cash to enable his convoy go through an illegal roadblock at Kachok. The operation dubbed No Vote ID, No Accessing Nyalenda, which was mounted at the city's major entry routes, so transport paralyzed for the better part of the day as the youth demanded that drivers and passengers confirm their voter registration status. Addressing the youth, Governor Ranguma, however, lauded the youth for the good job done in mobilizing people to register as voters. I'm very, very impressed by the people of Nyalenda. Those who have taken upon them to check on everybody to ensure that everyone has an ID and a voter's card. At the coast, opposition leader Raila Odinga called on his supporters to volunteer as agents to man all the polling stations across the country in a campaign dubbed Adopt a Polling Station. The campaign is similar to that used in Ghana to secure the presidency for Nana Akufo Ado. TC Kama wana ODM wana code wana NASA. Tumefanya mpango kambambe ya kuhalinda kura. Tunataka kila kituo cha kupiga kura nataka watu wajitokeze na itwa adapt a polling station. The party leader is not at work alone. In Migori County, local leaders have taken it upon themselves to go door to door ensuring those above 18 years register to vote and in turn receive goodies. Nifanya wa muzi pamoja na vijana wenzangu kuhakikisha ya kuwa kila mtu Migori County ambaya mefikisha umri wa kuchukua kura amejiandikisha kama mpiga kura. He is a wadi tunapeana, tunapeana ili tuimiza wale ambao wajachukua, waone umuhimu ya kuichukua. Those found having not registered are forced to go to the nearest registration center and register. This young man, for instance, was even given a ride and escort for that one crucial vote he holds. In Embu, Senator Leni Kivuti is not sleeping easy until when the numbers hit the desired target. In every polling station, there are 15 people who will go to door to door. And as you know, polling stations are not very far apart. Kutoka kwa one polling station to another is usually a walking distance. The senator has deployed more than 10,000 clerks to all registration stations across the country, tasked with registering 20 new voters each. The first thing is to identify. Tujue ni nani huyu ambaye hana akona kipande na hana kura. Tukisha njua ni huyu, tutanjaribu vire MBVR, tutanjua kwa sababu hizi MBVR sinatembezwa. Now, the electoral body, IEBC, however, has its reservations regarding various methods used. The bottom line is we all want all Kenyans to register as voters, but it's not proper to use improper means to make them register. It's a constitutional right. The right to vote is a constitutional right, and it should be done willingly. IEBC has so far registered well over 800,000 new voters, but is targeting about 6 million new voters by the end of the exercise. Akisa Wandera, KTN News. Well, like I mentioned, it is.